it's, you know, I, I fell in love with this place. It's the closest place to heaven as far as I'm concerned. And I always wanted to, to have a nice place and build something. And it just it truly amazes me that I was able to, to mill every single piece of wood that's in this place. I w went to Pecos High School in Pecos, New Mexico. I, uh, unfortunately, there was no uh, basketball team in our school. So I had to um, play the drum for the band, but I was fortunate enough to see the, this team called the All-American Redheads, and I got a tryout, and I played for them for a year, and that's when I really aspired to be a coach because I wanted to give girls and afford them the opportunity that I never got because I thought I was a pretty decent ball player, but I never got the, the chance to prove it. The sense that she has a passion for the game of basketball and a passion for opportunities just really resonates. She persevered and you know and she she loved the game. She knew she wanted to play. She made it happen and she took it to another level, you know, and, and, and that's that's something. You know, I first started coaching, there's five people in the stands and they're all uh, members of the family. Now we have the pit sold out, you know. We're a district championship sold out. It's just unbelievable how far girls basketball has come since the early days that I started coaching and how much we have done and I, and I hope and I feel that I'm part of that process that, that helped uh, bring uh, girls basketball to a forefront. She's always very understanding and, and wanting to help, you know, help people out. And so, you know, beyond the trophies and the state titles and, you know, the honors that she's received, I think for me that that's why I, I look up to her. Beyond her success on the basketball court is the fact that she's also remembered for raising money for a, a kid from Pecos who was suffering from cancer or working with a family who lost their uh, family members tragically in a car accident. Uh, the fact that she's known for that, as well as her successes on the basketball court, I think speak volumes to her legacy. I think what means the most is uh, the Peslakais and how that came about. I really believe that, you know, I could say the state title, but I think what happened was the help that we gave them and what we got in return, you know, we got another family. You know, I just feel a need to give back to people, you know, through basketball, through life, through whatever. You know, this was just a way to give back. And in, in reality, I got more from it than I could have ever given. And I just think it's important for other people, young ladies that, that you, are, you are teaching and trying to inspire for them to see that you care. It's not just about basketball, it's about life. <laughs>